Oh, okay. Hey babes, welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Jasmine. I would love for you to join the family, so click subscribe down below. Today, I'm gonna be trying out all 10 of the new Rare Beauty lipsticks. I am so excited. Rare Beauty released 10 lip liners and 10 lipsticks to go along with those lip liners, so we're gonna test them all out today. Do so swatches, and yeah, let's get into it. First things first, this is the beautiful PR package that they sent over. Selena looks gorgeous. I love the color that she's wearing on her lips. On the back of the box it just says kind words which is the name of this lipstick collection so this is the inside of the package these are all 20 products 10 lip liners and 10 lipsticks so we're gonna get started I'm gonna start out with the lighter shades and then move on to the deeper shades just so that way it's easier to take them off my lips as I go through the colors so I'm gonna swatch the lip liners as well as the lipsticks on my hand as well because some of the shades are gonna be too light for me I already know first color I'm gonna swatch is called talented and this is it here as you can tell, as you can tell, this lip liner would be way too light for me to use on my lips because it's just basically like a nude color. I can use this kind of like a lipstick, I guess, but not as a lip liner. So that one is talented. I'm going to swatch uh, creative. I'm going to go through the lip liners first. That way I can pick out which one I want to use for the lipsticks because I'm going to pick out a couple, a couple liners to use. This one is called, this shade is creative. So this is it here. A little bit deeper but definitely still too light for a lipstick on my on my complexion the next color is lively and this is lively here and I would use this as a lipstick all over my lips but not a lip liner so that's lively and I actually like that she has colors what she, I think she has what seems um, looking at these colors it seems like there's gonna be a shade for pretty much every skin zone but let's see this one is called worthy so this is worthy this one is humble this one I still wouldn't be able to use as a lip liner but I definitely can use this as a lipstick this is a really pretty color I'm excited for the lipstick in this shade because it looks really pretty next up we have the shade fun so let's see fun oh this is pretty this one is the shade wise so we're gonna put wise right here Okay, so this I can get with on my lips for sure. So this is Wise. You can see it's a little bit deeper than my skin tone. Keep this in mind. So Wise is described as a warm brown nude. So definitely I think this would work. Next up we have the shade Bold. Again, a really pretty color. This one looks like a more of a red-ish undertone. Um, this is described as a deep berry rose. Yes, so yeah definitely has a red tone to it these are the ones I feel like you guys if you're near my complexion these are the ones you should pay attention to <laughs> um the other ones are the other ones are great if you are a lighter skin tone but if you're like my skin tone definitely pay attention to these colors this one is gifted I'm gonna show you guys gifted first I have, I'm gonna show y'all gifted this is gifted here and I actually like the consistency of these. They feel really good. This is Gifted. Really pretty. Gifted is a deep, uh, dusty plum. And then this last one is called Strong. Strong is described as a rich chocolate. So let's see. Oh, yeah. This is Strong. Okay. I do want to give a reference um, to you guys the lip liner that I use all the time. So one of my go-to lip liners is this Makeup Forever one. So I wanted to show you guys next to these colors what that looks like. So this is it here. It's like almost in between these two shades so these are the lipsticks I love the packaging really nice really nice and sleek and then you just press and pull so this is the first shade this is it here creative this is it here oh this is not bad this this could work as a nude okay I wasn't sure if this would be able to go with my complexion but I think it can it's not looking powdery it's looking pretty nice i think this will be a really nice nude with a dark brown lip liner like the color strong for example it's a muted peach which these tones tend to work really nicely on my complexion um this next color called uh talented talented is a true natural beige so we're gonna i love this too wait a minute now i love this color as a nude oh my gosh this is so pretty all right, so next we're going to get into this color. It's called Lively. So let's see what Lively is described as. Lively is a rose pink. So we're going to swatch this one as well. I'm, by the, I am going to do lip swatches in case you were curious 
this is really pretty rose pink shade i don't usually do these shades but this is definitely really pretty the next one is called worthy okay so worthy is a worthy worthy is a muted mauve which i do 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 shades okay i love me a muted mauve so let's see Ooh, she pretty i love her <laughs> I love those shades with a nice muted mauve gloss. Oh, Fenty has one of the most perfect ones that can go with this color. Next up we have Humble. I don't know about you, but Kendrick Lamar literally took over the word Humble for me. Like I cannot think of the, I can't say the word Humble without thinking of his song Humble. This one is a rose mauve. I'm not sure how I'm going to feel about this one, but let's see. Okay. Mm, I don't know if it's my cup of tea, but it's cute. It's cute. It's cute. I'm going to try it on, though. This one is called Fun. Let's have some fun. This be is... Okay, this is neutral. This is a neutral mauve. So, neutral mauve. I'm actually really excited about how deep these shades are. Whoa. This looks really good. This I can kind of get behind. Next up, we have the shade Wise. Wise is a warm brown nude. So, let's see what that looks like. Ooh, these colors are giving 90s. Bold and bold is a deep berry rose. Okay, I don't usually wear that color, but I'm excited to see what it looks like. Then we have gifted. Let's see what that looks like. I don't run out of space. Let's go here. Ooh, this one's pretty. I love gifted. Um, my shirt is so white. I need to definitely clean this off as soon as I'm done with this section. Okay, this last one is strong. Strong is definitely gonna be that girl for the fall and winter. Yes. She's strong. Okay, so these are the swatches. They felt really good on my arms. So I'm, I'm gonna see how they feel on my lips in terms of texture. They felt really, really nice and smooth. So I'm gonna see how they felt on my lips. And then, yeah, let's start with wise and see like what that looks like. And then we can decide if we wanted to strong instead. Oh, this is nice. If you want a natural lip liner, I feel like this is a really pretty color for like a natural lip liner where it looks like you're barely wearing any lip liner, which I like. But since I am going to go in with a lot of those really light shades, I'm actually going to just take strong because I feel like it's just going to make the most sense. Okay, I will say this lip liner literally just glided right on my lips. It felt so smooth and I love the shade. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love this shade, y'all. Lip liner gets a 10 out of 10 in my books because it's really pretty. It glides on really smoothly and I think the shade is perfect. I think the shade is perfection. So love the shade strong for lip liner. Would definitely recommend. Let me go wipe my arm because I am literally like, um, I'm so nervous that I'm going to mess up my shirt. So I'm going to go wipe my arm and I'll be back. So we're going to do that first. Mm, girl, okay. Absolutely love. Absolutely love this. <laughs> I'm about to stop this video right here because I'm about to wear this today. This is such a beautiful, first of all, combo. But the color is really pretty, especially with this lip liner. Like this, with this lip liner, this color, this color is a go. Okay, so this first color, Talented. Talented gets a check in my book. Paired with a dark brown lip liner, Talented is definitely that girl. Okay, so we're going to move on to the next. The next color is Creative. So we're going to do that. Let me wipe my lips. If I need more lip liner, then I'll apply it as I go. But this is Creative. It looks really pretty in the container. This is creative. Yeah, this is really pretty as well, but I think I like Talented better. Next, we have Lively. I feel like I've never put on a lipstick in this shade. Like, I am looking at this like I have never seen this color on my lips before, um, which is crazy because I have tried so many different colors and products. I'm going to add some lip liner. 
I don't usually do these types of shades. Y'all, I love this color. I don't lie. I love this color. This looks really pretty. This is a really pretty shade and I almost don't even know if I would have picked it up on my own. But I'm glad that I have it because this is such a beautiful shade. Okay. Lively caught me by surprise. So, so far, lively and talented is it for me. This one is worthy. Let's see what worthy looks like. So this is Worthy. It's a muted mauve. This is not a shade that I typically wear, but I think it looks pretty good. I think with a lip gloss, this would look really, really like. Like with a clear gloss, it would just really make it pop and look extra beautiful on my complexion. So this is fun. It's a neutral mauve. Let's see, fun. this is fun fun is not my typical color of choice but this is what it looks like next we have wise so this is wise this is a warm brown nude so these feel really like smooth and like silky and creamy not drying at all I love this. I love. <laughs> this is really pretty. This is definitely my second favorite. My first favorite is that first color, y'all. That first color was so pretty. It's giving straight up 90s and I love, love it. All right, so that is wise. So that's wise, let's take that off. So next up we have bold. Bold is a deep berry rose, so let's see what bold is given. <laughs> let's see what bold is given. Oh, okay okay this is pretty I don't think I've ever even used a color like this before it's just so pretty this is so pretty I love this color so this is bold okay bold so bold okay bold is number two in my books right now because I love bold this is really nice I love a red toned lipstick and this I love Okay, this is Gifted. Gifted is a deep, dusty plum. I don't know what that's gonna look like, but let's see. Oh. Okay, deep, dusty plum. I see you. This is pretty. This goes on my eye look really well. Definitely straight up 90s. I love this. Did I just get this? Y'all, I love this color. It's given 90s for sure. Really, really pretty. This one and um, bold are a tie. Like, I really love these two colors. These are these are a tie for me. To the last, huh? The last shade is called Strong. Okay, Strong. I love the name of this color because it's strong. So, let us try it. Let's try it on. I already know I'm going to love this. Who am I kidding? <laughs> Period. I love this color, you guys. This is definitely a really beautiful deep brown color. I've never, I have, I do have a few of these. I do have a few shades that are similar to this in my collection, but this one is definitely different. I love the tone. I love the shade. I love the feel of the lipstick. They're very like moisturizing this booklet came with the collection i just wanted to see it says that they are long wear shades i'm definitely excited about that i feel like a shade like this i can use the lip liner all over my lips to make it last even longer it's a smooth glide ultra creamy matte formula i definitely can see how they are ultra creamy and matte because they're definitely not shiny but like i said they are very creamy very like hydrating feeling but they're not shiny like they don't look like those you know shiny lipsticks she says it's waterproof and it won't smudge, feather, or fade. What? Okay, <laughs> that's crazy. Um, it says complete with built-in sharpener. Oh, these are the lip liners, y'all. Okay, um, my bad. These are the lip liners. I'm like, what? Okay, these are the lip liners. It has a built-in sharpener. That's amazing. So, love that. 
Okay, so she says this is everything I ever wanted in a lip liner. Super smooth and doesn't tug on your lips. Made to last all day without feeling sticky. These are definitely true. These claims are true because I can tell the lip liners are very smooth, but they are definitely like a matte finish. Now for the lipsticks. High pigment, one swap color, cushiony, comfortable all day wear, weightless and soft matte finish. Yeah, the finish is definitely soft matte. It is very creamy as well so it doesn't say creamy on here but they do feel creamy like the lip liner description and it does feel cushiony for sure and high pigment is definitely true so i love that they do feel weightless i think the claims for the claims i feel i feel like the claims are true the only claim that i can't test right now is the lip liner claims but as far as the lipstick claims these all seem to be true the goal was to create a classic lipstick that was truly comfortable and I feel like these feel comfortable. They definitely feel really nice and comfy. And this color makes my lip look a little bit more plump. And so did another one of the shades I tried earlier. I think it was Bold. I don't remember. But they I can see the plump look that it gives because this is one of the claims that people gave. And then lips feels cushiony, not dried. 100%. My lips do not feel dry or cakey. That is great. And I'm excited. In case you wanted to see this is also inside the booklet I thought this was a fun page to show y'all this is also inside the booklet so yeah all right y'all so that is it for the video let me know what your favorite shades are let me know what you're picking up I will have links to all the lipsticks and lip liners down below and I will leave a little emoji next to my favorites I'll leave this emoji next to my favorites so you guys know which ones are my faves and, and I have them linked on Red Beauty's website because you can get 10% off. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.